When it comes to bypassing blocks, VPN is the number one tool. But what if it gets blocked? Well, this is a tutorial on how to bypass VPN blocks with all possible solutions and troubleshooting tips. To figure out how to bypass VPN blocker issues, it helps to first understand why are VPNs blocked in the first place, because the troubleshooting steps might differ. One of the most common reasons is having your VPN blocked in school or your workplace. These places restrict access to VPNs so you wouldn't be able to open websites they deem untrustworthy. What's more, some network providers and ISPs like to snoop around your browsing data and then well, sell it. And since a VPN can prevent that, well, you might have your VPN blocked by your ISP. You might get your VPN blocked by some websites too. Reasons for this range from fraud prevention to legal issues. And of course, a very common answer to why is my IP blocked is copyrights. That's especially true when it comes to streaming platforms, as they have geographical licensing restrictions and you bypassing them, well, isn't ideal. Now, if you're wondering, can VPN bypass IP ban? Yes, in this case, only a specific IP gets blocked. So the problem should be solved by simply connecting to a VPN as it assigns you a new IP address. And lastly, there's also the case of online censorship. Some countries deem VPN usage illegal. So when you go online, you could only see what they want you to see, losing access to free internet. Now, the best VPN options have measures against blocks, and I'll show you how to use them. Oh, and if you don't have a VPN yet, well, I left links to my most reliable recommendations in the description below, along with an exclusive Cyber News discount. All right, let's start from the simplest solution, changing the VPN server. This solution mostly applies to unblocking sites like streaming platforms or if you've encountered a site block because of VPN usage. For demonstration purposes, I'm using NordVPN, mostly because it has a ton of servers. It actually took me a while to find a server that's blocked, and well, that's a good sign. Nord is usually great at bypassing VPN blocks, but it's not immune to it. So to fix this error, all it takes is switching a server. Let me just reload the page and I'm in. Now let's say that didn't work. Another step would be clearing your cache and cookies right here in your browser settings. This won't do anything for things like VPN censorship, but it should fix streaming platform problems. Another solution to getting your VPN blocked is changing the tunneling protocol. Sometimes these blocks can apply to specific protocols so you can go into the settings, change it, and try it out with another one. Just keep in mind that this might impact your speeds, especially if you opt to use OpenVPN TCP. It's safer, but way slower. Okay, next up, how to bypass VPN blocks that restrict using the VPN itself. Now this one is a bit of a tougher cookie, but traffic obfuscation is a great solution to crack it. It's a special VPN feature that disguises your VPN traffic as a regular one. The process can be different depending on the VPN that you use. For example, on NordVPN, you can choose it in the specialty servers, while on Surfshark, traffic obfuscation is called the camouflage mode, and it runs automatically when you choose any open VPN tunneling protocol. So if you're getting your VPN blocked at work, school, or if you're facing government censorship, this might be your best solution. If all else fails and your VPN is still not working, I would suggest contacting customer service. You can just drop a message in the live chat and they're pretty quick to respond, as most of them have 24 seven live customer service. If they aren't able to solve your problem, there's likely one of two things happening. You are asking for the impossible <laughs> or you chose the wrong VPN. It's important to choose the right VPN, and it might take some research to find the VPN that can do exactly what you want it to do. There is no single best VPN 2023 out there, but I can give a few recommendations of the best VPNs for bypassing blocks. And by the way, if you find these recommendations or this video helpful, subscribe to the channel or like the video. I'll be eternally grateful.
Anyway, as for the VPNs, I already mentioned NordVPN because of the high server amount. Nord is also one of the best picks to fight VPN blocks since it has specialty obfuscated servers. It's also a great pick if you're fighting internet censorship. There's even an emergency free VPN program that they offer for extreme censorship cases. Surfshark is another great pick for VPN blocks, specifically if you're using a VPN for streaming. It has servers in 100 countries, so I'm able to access a lot of foreign libraries with minimal troubleshooting. It's also a bit cheaper than NordVPN, while being just as capable. And finally, I can recommend IPVanish for those who are often trying to unblock content in faraway locations. This VPN showed me excellent speeds on distant servers. So by now, you should know the best ways on how to bypass VPN blocks and the best VPNs to do so. If you have any questions, drop a comment below. If not, hey, thanks for watching. Don't forget to grab a special VPN discount from that box in the corner or watch a comparison I did of the three most popular VPN picks. I'll see you there.